Andrew McCart, IFL TV in association with MTK Global. I'm here in Manchester ahead of Claw versus Urkiaga. Yeah. With me, I've got Gamal Yafai. I mean, you've been out the ring for what was it, 14 Four, months? 14 months, yeah. I mean, there was no ring loss there, was there? Yeah, well, um, nah, not really. performance? Nah, not really. It was a good performance. It's a matter of when I've been out of the ring for 14 months. Um, but I took, took my time, put the gears in the third round, and eventually got him out of there. But, um, Glad to be back, man. It's been a long time. Yeah, you've got a smile on your face, yeah. so you are glad to be back. But was the game plan to go out there and get mm -hmm. stop them or um, nah, just, just, been just get, so Yeah, just get the, truck, get the rounds, but then up the gears. If, if, it, if the stoppage felt like it was coming in, you got to take it. Um, come with a few right hands to the body and you know they're hurting. Obviously, he's a southpaw, so I had to you know, bang the right hand out through the middle. Did a few times and I said he was hurt, so I put the gears and took him out eventually. Definitely, it was a good performance, well, a good stoppage as well. So, the 14 months you've been out the ring, for people that don't know, can you elaborate on why you've been out for so long? Well basically I fought in Birmingham back in September, um, so yeah, 14 months ago, and uh, I had to my boys up in the third round of a fight, eventually I won and knocked the kid out, the kid was a tough kid, um, I caught him with um, a left hook, I think it was a left hook, yeah, and then um, knocked him out, but I brought to my right boy, my right boy, so, so then obviously I had a time out, so I got it operated on, I was back, I was scheduled to be back, in April 26th on a design show where Eddie had sorted out and then um, the week before I was sparring in my last spar and then I ruptured this bicep <laughs> so you could you couldn't no, really honestly bicep, yeah. <laughs> so um so then I ruptured this bicep so I was like you know like but what's you know what's it got what's going on here I'm wearing due pro and all there's something wrong with my biceps but I got got this operated on and then I'm back today <laughs> but my, my arms feel good and then I'm ready to go now that's what's in the bite of the, the yeah, yeah, well, the surgeons, it's very rare it will happen to get but twice to an arm. So if you've had it operated on, it'd be fine. It should be fine, 99%. So I'm, I feel strong, you know, I'm, you know, I'm punching hard. So I'm punching harder. Mm -hmm. it, I've been out four months, but I feel like I'm punching really hard. I'm, you know, like, I feel matured and strong at Super Bantam right now. I feel like I can beat anyone at, at, at that level, at, at European level, especially. So, um, I'm man managing to vote for the European, hopefully Eddie can get that over here. If not, then I'm happy to travel and I'll get that title away from him. I mean, you've only had one fight in 2019, so yeah. 2020, you're hoping for big things? Probably big things are early next year. I want to, you know, get, in a, get going, you know, hopefully get three fights next year and just crack on. And I don't want to be fighting any more, you know, um, journey or anything like that. No disrespect to him, I just want to crack on now, fight for the European title and win that and then push on. Because I'm I'm your, no I'm I'm 28 but I feel like I, this felt like my debut today because I've been out of the ring so long um, so I, I feel fresh I feel feel like like a kid still you know what I mean I've, I'm experienced now I'm um, you know this this 40 months has been hard to start you know not being able to fight and that but you know what, I think it's been good it's been, it's, I think it's been beneficial for me as well so feeling good now I'm ready to go. You said that you're the, the, after the European, that's the, the fight you won, but do you have like one eye on this Cass Ash fight, Johan fight tonight? I mean, that, that's quite well, a good fight for you. Um, no, if you it was above him just now? It did, well, because of Manchester for the European, mm -hmm. I'd want to fight for that, but don't get me wrong, like if Eddie Aaron offered it me and you know, it was good money and whatever, then I'd have to, I'd have to jump out, you know what I mean? Well, I wouldn't, it's one of them, it's, if you're fighting for, if you're offered a Manchester shot for European, you're going to take it, I'd be dumb not to, you know what I mean? Um, so, but we see things change, and I'm willing to fight anybody. I mean, and I'm good, and, and and I'm good enough to beat him as well. So, well, that's it. What is the the? I mean, yeah, this might be the dumbest question. Like, yeah. What is the end goal? You still hoping for that world title? Shot my my end goal is a world title. Yeah. I, I won't I won't be happy. Like, if I don't win a world title, I will not be happy. You know what I mean? I, like, honestly, like people might think I'm not good enough. Whatever, I don't I don't care what people think. You know what I mean? Like, I I think I'm can win a world title and I'll prove it, I'm telling you, I'll prove it. Give, give, give me two years, I'll have a world title. Brown Rice, 100%. I won't keep you much longer, I know your, your brothers are down there. I mean, how much inspiration does your big brother Cal give you? I mean, he's, well, yeah, he's probably, I think somebody put out a list out on Twitter that he's the seventh, seventh longest yeah, yeah. reigning world champion. Yeah. I mean, that's some achievement in itself, yeah, isn't it? You know what, you know, it's, 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 it's uh, you know, like, the brothers push me, my, even my above I you know, but to, for the Olympics, uh, Olympic team, you know, mm -hmm. I'm both, you know, I want to, you know, I want to I wanna do big things in boxing, I want to, obviously my brother's got a world title, um, and I'm, he's professional like me, so I want to win a world title now, I want to, you know, um, I, think I, des I think I deserve, I think I deserve it, what I've been through the past four months has been, you know, shit, but, 
I'm here now and I'm, I'm the good, here. The good thing is, is you've got a smile on your face, which yeah. you get to see. So I'm here now, I'm ready to take over now. Seriously, I'll I, I fight anybody, man. Definitely, I won't keep you much longer. Thanks. Thank you. Welcome back. Thank you much, brother. Thank you. Cheers.